Excellency permit me to hand over this. The United Nations mission in South Sudan on Tuesday handed over various education material meant for pupils of Sindiro Primary School in Lobono to Secretariat officials in Juba State. The items include 150 school bags, admin's branded t-shirts, 750 exercise books, and an assortment of pens, pencil, water bottles, and balls. Pupils of Sindiru Primary have been out of school since mid-August clashes between cattle keepers and farming communities. Parents and community members requested the material after fighting destroyed homesteads and forced children out of learning environments. The items which were handed over to the state authorities are inscribed with messages to promote peace and inculcate a culture of peace in the children. The United Nations official leading the team at the handover ceremony emphasized that the mission's contribution was also aimed at creating awareness among the school and community. Some of these materials, the exercise book for example, has these messages. For example, it says, a conflict protects schools, meaning that we should not destroy school materials during conflict. Because the children are not the one fighting, so we should leave their materials. There are some of the materials there too, like pencil, like all that, or pen. The pen, for example, has a uh, peace message. The bag that we put, the things also have peace message. So when the children are reading and looking at this, we feel that awareness of peace will be created in their minds. The ANMIS official said the UN will in future partner with other agencies and institutions to expand such interventions to other crisis affected schools. Education is a very important uh, matter. The United Nations has agreed that sustainable development number four is a key concept of development. And therefore, we should endeavor to make sure we have education. I believe what can actually prepare education is peace. If we can have peace in South Sudan, not if we will have peace in South Sudan by the grace of God. It's not if we will have it. Yeah. Yes. So when we have peace in South Sudan, education will be easier to fund, it will be easier to implement. Therefore, we are using the opportunity to also implore all parties to find a way to ensure that peace reigns in the Republic of South Sudan. The State Minister for Education, Wani Sule, received the material and thanked ANMIS for the support. Uh, we assure you that these school materials will be the responsibility of the State Minister of Respons uh, Education, Juveg State, to make sure that they reach the target that they are intended for. And for this we assure you, and the Commissioner as well, that uh, we will facilitate the transportation of some of these materials once uh, the green light is given that the road is safe enough for us to reach here. Following an integrated assessment mission to Lobonok at the end of August, another mission aimed at delivering material requested straight to the school at the end of September was prevented to proceed to deliver the material in Lobonok County. The team turned back at the Juba Bridge.